Hey everyone, this is Lucky70x, and welcome to my next LP. Uh, as you can see from the imagery above, and the fact that there's two screens, we are playing a Yoshi's Island game, and we're playing a DS game. Thus, we are playing Yoshi's Island DS. In fact, I didn't even notice that until now, but it actually says that on the bottom screen. So, and it also says it on the title of the video. So really, you guys already knew that, but that's okay. Um, so, uh, we're going to have a little recap of the story here. Let's start with that. Uh, this is actually the sequel to the first game, which is Super Mario World 2 slash Yoshi's Island 1, I guess. And Baby Mario uh, saved uh, Baby Luigi from, with the help of the Yoshis, because apparently Baby Luigi can't save himself because he's a baby. And yeah, and Kamek stole them because he likes to steal infants. Whatever. Plot the first game. Oh my god, Purple Cloud. Oh my god, another Purple Cloud. This is so exciting. Um, oh my god, Purple Castle. Oh my god, it's Kamek the Baby Snatcher. I wonder what he's up to. He couldn't possibly be snatching babies. Oh my god, he is. Yeah, apparently he didn't learn his lesson from the first game. He thought, hey, my plan failed the first time. I know, let's steal more babies. Look at all the babies he has now. He has a freaking infant fetish, I guess. Oh, okay, we're getting into creepy territory here. I'm talking really fast in this video. I apologize. I'm already apologizing when I'm even through the opening cutscene. But hey, it's Baby Mario, Baby Luigi, and Baby Peach, and Baby Fuzzy Hair Guy. Who has a brown bag because he's a rebel. Anyway, so as you can see, Kamek has stolen a bunch of babies. They even have like the to oh, well those two token black babies, I guess. Oh god, now I'm even going there. What is wrong with me at the start of this LP? Oh well. And the stork's attacking! Oh my god, oh wow, that stork's drilling through that toady's brain there. That has to be painful. Oh, well, there we go, there's the start of our game. So hey guys, welcome to Yoshi's Island DS. I've already said that, but who cares? We're gonna press start and keep going. Um, hey, we got a new file here. Now, I'm gonna quickly talk about the LP, though. Um, well, first of all, you guys probably noticed that I have, like, a little barrier in the center there for the, uh, whatchamacallit, the DS divider. Uh, the game's kind of weird, and that, the perspective looks really weird if I don't do that, so I apologize in advance that that's annoying. Uh, you'll see what I'm going to do for the most part. I'm actually going to be having it on one screen at a time for the most part, so don't worry about it too much. Um, yeah, let's start a game. Adventure, because we want to go on an adventure. Um, and yes, this is going to be a 100% run, pretty much, so I'm going to get 100 on all the courses. We'll see what that entails later. Oh yeah, so Yoshi's enjoying a beautiful day of leisurely stroll. Gee, I sure hope babies don't rain down from the sky. Well, crap. Yep, that's right, babies came down from the sky. Hey, it's baby Mary Poppins, apparently, because she has an umbrella. Miraculously, the babies appear to be just fine. Yeah, somehow, I don't know. One of them looks very familiar to Yoshi. He sounds even more familiar. How can you forget that crying? My god. Anyway, Kamek's like, well, crap, we just happened to drop the one baby that screwed up my plans last time. God damn it, I hope he doesn't run away Yoshi. And of course he did. Anyway, he's uh, rightfully pissed because now his little baby snatching group is incomplete and who hell? I mean, I hate having an incomplete baby snatching group. It's just a horrible thing. Everyone's really confused, but that's okay. Incompetent fools! The hoodies are like, dude, just chill. And they're all heading to the giant floating purple castle in the sky. And Cam explains to reveal he's kidnapping babies from all around the world. Because you know, like having one demographic of babies isn't enough. You have to steal from every demographic. It's just not complete otherwise. Hey, it's the stork. I love the stork. He's such a cool guy. Drills, drill pecks, uh, toadies in the head and everything. Anyway, Baby Mario can't see him by himself because somehow he's able to comprehend all this. Jeez, he must be the smartest little baby ever. Which is funny because he grows up to become a plumber. Irony. Well, technically Mario is a doctor as well, I guess, but... Whatever. Let's go on a run with the stork. The stork's coming up this... Oh, this uh, they, 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 I can't talk. The stork's coming up us. That's cool. All right, welcome back to Yoshi's Island. This is the intro uh, thing. So let's go ahead and do some intro talking stuff. Um, let me try to remember the controls here. So B jumps. Uh, A shoots eggs, which we don't have any yet. And Y runs with Baby Mario and also uh, activates the tongue. You can also use X to look up and down, which I can't really do. Oh, I can do that. Cool. Uh, by, you can sw switch screens. Now, as you can see, I'm going to zoom in right now, and I'm going to be playing on this screen only, or unless I need to show something on the other screen. Alright, see so enemies, you make eggs. Uh, if you hold an L, you can lock the target. If you hold an up, you can make it stay up. 
So that's really all you need to worry about with eggs, and you can you press A again to shoot them. Um, so yeah, that's just the basic controls. Uh, start will pause the game as well as show the status screen, I'll show that once we get to an actual level. Now what I'm going to do in terms of timing this LP, I'm going to do one episode, or with the floor jump, if you hold in the jump button you can float kind of like that. On these things, you press the jump on, you can go really high. I'm going to grab all these coins because they're useless. 100 gives you a life as usual. Um, now what I'm going to do for this LP is I'm going to be doing, for the most part, one episode per level. Unless it's so... Oh, damn it! I didn't mean to do that. Unless it's short enough where I can get them all fit to fit in within uh, one level. Or, what am I saying? Um, if I can fit two in one episode, like one 15-minute thing, I will actually do that, though. But don't count it, because these levels will probably be just long enough to not make it. Haha. <laughs> Alright, so, uh, oh, you also, also have to press down to lay eggs. I think I forgot to say that. You swallow enemy, you press down. If you press Y again, you'll actually shoot them out. Alright, so flowers and score. Let's talk score. I like score. Uh, if you look up there, then uh, you see that you need to get 100 points per level. Now, what you do is you need to find 20 red coins, which look like regular coins, but they're different. Five flowers and get 30 stars. Now, I didn't actually show the stars, actually, yet. Um, stars are your health. You have 10 of them. If you hit, hit the guy... You'll lose Baby Mario and he'll start crying, and you'll lose stars. Uh, you'll always go back to, up to 10, but you need to get uh, collect star items to get more, to get 30. And if you have 30 at the end of the level, you'll get, be able to get 100%. If you have all the other stuff as well. So, yeah. I mean, if you haven't played Yoshi's Island before, hopefully that's a good enough job explaining things. And those are red coins right there, so let's go on a run. Uh, Baby Mario can run. This game uh, is different from Yoshi's Island. Uh, well... Let's talk about the differences. Um, first of all, you guys will be disappointed probably to hear, this game only has five worlds. The original had six, this one only has five. But this game does make up for having a few different mechanics, I guess. Uh, it has a bunch of different babies you can use, which is good. Because more babies is more fun, according to Kamek. Um, and then... Um, it does have a lot of extra levels as well, which I'll be doing all of those. Um, so yeah, that's the basic gist of things. Um, so what we're going to do is... We're going to beat this level, why not? And then there also are a couple other new things which I'll show off. Um, overall, this game holds up as a Yoshi's Island title. I like the original better, but this one's still pretty darn good. I mean, it's a, it's a solid entry in the Yoshi's series, I suppose. I'd rank it better than Yoshi's Story, in my opinion, at least, and that, that's always a good sign, I guess. Is there anything down here? Yeah, you can usually uh, find little hidden question block, block things, which is always good. Alright, pipes! I like pipes. Pipes are cool. If you don't have uh, six eggs, six is your max. These guys will keep- this pipe will keep spawning shy guys until you have six. Hey, it's a flower. Let's grab it. Oh, I'm gonna bounce in your head. What are you- what are you gonna do about that? You can also actually go in the pipe to get shy guys as well. Although, usually- I mean, sometimes there's actually items in these pipes, but usually there's not. Um, so yeah, we have six. That's good. I like having six eggs. I can shoot them at things. I like being able to shoot things at things and whatnot. Things. Alright, we're gonna drop a seed, and it's gonna grow into a plant instantaneously because for some reason flowers grow really fast in this world. That's cool of me. I love music, it's so peaceful. Alright, so this level is actually pretty easy to get 100%. It's pretty short as well. Um, oh shoot, where were they aiming that? That wasn't even close to where I wanted to aim it. My finger kind of slipped on the button there, actually, to be honest. Alright, so we're gonna grab this, which is another flower. Can I grab this with the hover jump? Thank you for the flutter jump. Life here, and we'll actually use this shy guy's face to break up this block, which has more stars in it. 25? 25 is good. We're actually gonna get, uh, middle rings. Let's talk about middle rings. If you, uh, you can restart the stage if you, uh, die here with all the, th you know, items you've had before, before, including stars. Um, you also get 10 stars for passing the ring, so that's usually a good way to, if you ever, like, don't think you'll be able to make it with stars, uh, use that to just go back, I guess. Because usually you can get 30 stars and then just keep trying until you actually beat the level without getting hit. Luckily for this time we're not going to get hit because I'm too good. Watch me get hit. Alright, I think that's everything. This would have 5 stars, but we already have it, so it's going to be 5 coins. Oh, I didn't explain that when I just got in that thing. Uh, the Baby Mario token that I just got. There's one token in every level. Uh, this guy will explain it right here. Talk to me. Um, you can there's one in each level. You want to click them. Uh, it's part of the 100% run that I'm going to be doing, so I'll be getting all of those as well. Um, I'll explain what they do later, what they unlock. But uh, they'll have a certain baby's face on it. You can only get it with that baby. So later on when we have more babies, we'll have to worry about that. Anyway, let's go into the goal. If you get the gold roulette and you land on the thing, 
I better have gotten 100%. I didn't. If you land on a flower, you get a bonus game. And we'll get a bonus game next time, hopefully. And there we go. Is that 100? That's 100. Look at that. We got 100 in the first level. We're doing well so far. That's why I like to see progress. Alright, so in the next episode, we're going to go ahead and do stage 1-2, and maybe 1-3 if it goes fast enough. I'm not trying to remember how fast 1-2 is. Ah, we'll find out. So yeah, uh, this is our next Let's Play. I hope you guys enjoy it. Yoshi's Island DS. Oh, you know, one more thing I want to talk about quickly. Uh, another difference I just remember off the top of my head. Uh, there's no items in this game, so don't expect me to be able to hoard items and use that to get 100. Like, the, uh, you know, that makes it a little more challenging, because you actually have to get 30 stars the legit way in each level. So, that's going to be fun. I'm probably going to scream. And I know you guys like to hear me scream. So, enjoy! Uh, this is Lucky70X signing out. I will see you guys next time for the next Yoshi's Island DS. Welcome to the next Let's Play. Let's have some fun. See you guys later.